Itsu, come here. Oops, Itsu, over here. Yela, Itsu, Leonardo. I knew you were behind the break-in at Sant'Angelo. It is good to see you, friend. Come here. Forgive me. The Borja have commandeered my services. Actually, they would have killed me had I refused. What do they want? War machines. I have constructed weapons for all the Borja guards and other terrible monstrosities besides. They are very well designed, Ezio. Here, the names of the Templars overseeing their construction. Cesare intends to supply his army with my creations. You must dismantle them. Grazie. I will take care of the plans and the machines. There is far graver news, I am afraid. They have the apple. Yes, I know. I gave the apple to Mario. I am sorry, Ezio. Cesare left it in my hands to study, to make it work. Then Rodrigo took it from me. I know not where. I will recover it in time. Leonardo, I have lost all the codex inventions you once fashioned for me. Hmm. Remaking them will be easy. I never forget the design. But you must compensate me for the raw material. Really? They are not paying you at Il Vaticano? Very, very little. If we are to do this, we must appear to not meet at all. Pointing. It's pointing to where you should sit. So, sit! Yes, Maestro. I can kill double the guards. Desmond, I've scanned Leo's location into the map so you can keep track of him when he moves. To synchronize with Ezio, you will have to destroy Leo's machines. I've marked the whereabouts of the Templars overseeing their construction. I'll update the map where the machine's locations are found. of Roma has begun. Your actions are truly noble. Allow my fury to strike with yours.
After you. Come here, friend. Don't I know you? Watch the weapon carefully. We must be ready to take it to safety should anything happen.
Look. Heavy. Where have you been? We all have our secrets. I took the liberty of setting up a means of communication with your recruits. We send orders via carrier pigeon. Thank you, Machiavelli. Bartolomeo sends his apologies. The French have doubled their assault. Claudia. Ezio. All right. I have a plan to deal with the Borgia. We can either go after supplies or Cesare's followers. My plan is to attack both. If we cut off his funds, Cesare will lose his army and return without his men. So, I ask you, where does he get his money? Volpe? Agostino Chigi is the Pope's moneylender, but Cesare does business with someone else. As of now, all we know is that he is called the Banker. I know someone who owes the Banker money. Senator Rigidio Troche comes in all the time and complains. Bene, I will follow up on that lead. French soldiers are guarding the road back into the castello. Once Cesare arrives, you will never get to him. I intend to kill the French general. With him dead, Bartolomeo will have the Frenchmen on the defensive, and they will abandon their posts on the bridge. Even with those troops gone, the Papal Guard will continue to protect the inner gate. There is a side entrance. Lucrezia's latest plaything, Pietro, has a key. He was at the castello. Come see me later. I will have my thieves ascertain his location. Where are you going? I am of no use to anyone without Forley. I leave to be with my children, and await the restoration of my lands. 
I wish you would stay. You are the leader of the assassins now. Unite them, Ezio Auditore, and take back Roma. Vittoria agli assassini! Vittoria agli assassini.